Hello and welcome to the Phone Burner Training. This is the Don't Be Complicated Training Series. My name is Jeff Osnes. I will be the host for this training. Uh, if you want to reach out to me, you can send me an email directly to jeff at phoneburner.com. And today I'm going to talk about starting a dial session in Salesforce. So when you log into your Salesforce account, you will need to install the Phone Burner app. This is not a training on how to install the Salesforce, uh, Salesforce Phone Burner app. This is only to start a dial session once you've installed and set up the Phone Burner app. So uh, in your app drawer in the upper right hand corner, you'll see the Phone Burner app. You must have that installed before you can actually begin a dial session. Now you don't have to begin a dial session from the Phone Burner app. Uh, you actually begin dial sessions from either the leads section or the contacts section. So if you go to contacts, what you'll need to do is load a view. So pick any one of your views. Obviously your views will be different than my views. But if you select a view and hit go, you'll see your contacts listed there. If you wanted to start a dial session, you'd select the contacts you want to call. And you can select multiple contacts. You can select an entire page at a time or cherry pick. And then you press the Begin Phone Burner Session button. When you press that button, that's going to bring up a Phone Burner Dial Session window. Here you're going to need to go ahead and enter your Phone Burner username and password. And then you'll log in. Phone Burner is going to validate that you have an active Phone Burner account. And it's going to authorize the two connections. And then we're going to go ahead and continue. Now you're going to see the options that you normally see when you start a phone burner session through phoneburner.com. You can choose your voicemail, you can choose your disposition set, and then you continue. Then all you need to do is dial into the number. I'm going to go ahead and call into that number so you can see what the dial session lo window looks like when we start making calls. All right, so now that we're connected, we just need to hit the start dialing button, and the system will start queuing up the first contact. I'm going to go ahead and pause that dial session so that we can talk about what you're seeing here in the dial session window. What you got here in the dial session window is the actual contact details pulled from the Salesforce system. So you'll notice it looks like what you would see in Salesforce. If we were to open up one of these contact records, you'll notice that it is the contact details section. So essentially what PhoneBurner does is it takes the contact details and loads it into the dial session window so that you can edit individual pieces. If you need to edit something that is not part of the contact details, you can click on Edit in Salesforce. And that'll actually open up the full contact record real quickly so that you can edit any additional details that you, name, you may need to update during the dial session. But in the dial session itself, you have access to the contact details and anything that's in the contact details. You'll notice that it's all of these sections that are part of the contact details. If there's something that you want to have access to during the dial session without having to edit in Salesforce, it needs to be something that can be added to these the contact details section within the contact itself. Once you disposition a call, if you click on any of the dispositions, PhoneBurner is actually going to add a status or an activity history. It's going to automatically add this activity history directly back to your Salesforce account with the status. That way you know exactly what happened. So you've got left message. Any status that the system uses will be pushed back. So if we mark this one as a follow-up, and call our next contact. Now if we refresh this contact record, you'll see follow-up was just added. Once again, I want to point out that you can begin a dial session from either contacts or leads. So either contacts or leads, you can begin a dial session. And that's how you start a dial session in Salesforce. Once again, our phone burner pricing, it's uh, for seven and a half hours, it's $67.50 a month. It gives you 450 minutes of usage. Phone burner unlimited is $149 a month, and that allows you to use it all day long. If you do not already have a phone burner account, you need to get one today. 
You can set up an account at phoneburner.biz, and we'll talk to you soon. Happy dialing.